Oh, in the forward driving area of the uh, KFC 251. Um, we have in the center here, we have a, a three uh, levers. Uh, the first lever is much like your your car of your, your brake, park and brake, and that's what it is. It's a park and brake, and then it gets released before we drive. And then we have two differential braking levers. Uh, we affectionately call these here the uh, manual power steering levers because if you're not using these and you're just trying to steer the front wheels and make turns with this, um, you pretty much need to be uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Um, it's, it's, you have to be pulling and turning and the things, you, you're just going to, in uh, less than five minutes, you'll come out of here with a uh, work up a good sweat. So it'll be a good workout. If you want that workout, then we don't use these. But when you do use these in leading a turn, we basically pull left and right, or left and right, whatever side you want to turn, you pull that side as you steer, and it really makes this literally like a power steering vehicle. It's uh, really unique. Um, that makes it easier to drive, and it makes it turn very sharp uh, when, you can, when you differential brake like that. It's a, basically a four-speed transmission with reverse uh, that gets locked out with the lever there so you don't accidentally engage it. We have a high and a low um, transfer um, case here. So basically, the pedals are much like a car. You have a, a clutch pedal, a brake pedal, and a gas pedal. The thing about the gas pedal is you can see there's a roller on it, which you don't normally see. This roller is, uh, for some reason, they decided that they wanted you in control of pulling it back and pushing it forward. So you would actually have to adjust. If you got too much gas, you would have to get to roll your foot under there and pull it back. And that's also how you shut the, shut the vehicle off as well. Standard steering uh, wheel again. You, also, you, you would drive that with one hand and use your differential braking. I'm going to go ahead and start it up. Generally, um, German vehicles uh, of this age need a starting fluid to start them, so we don't have that primed, but we, we can go ahead and engage a starter, and you can hear the engine turn over. So, again, it will not start without... Um, starting fluid, which we have not uh, have my ground crew engage in. So uh, that's basically the dr driving compartment of the 251.